Hi, I'm Peter Haddock and I'm here with Dave Ozel and he is the site manager for MJL Contractors here in Westwood Ho. And Dave, we've got a brand new Volvo here right next to us, the EC220 EL model. It's got a full NCON tilt rotator controlled by the MC1 Leica Geosystems system that's been installed by One Point Survey. And uh, we'll be talking to them also on this site visit. Basically, you're digging for a house builder and there's plot after plot going in, isn't there? Really helps you do that work, doesn't it? Work-wise, with uh, less engineering, cost-effective, perfect every time on the footings, uh, whereas before we were relying on string lines and spray paint in cold, wet weather. Uh, that's all been eliminated now. So cost-effective on paint, time, effort, all across the board. And you're obviously in an in a area here where they're really trying to build the houses as quick as possible as well, because there's huge demand here um, in this area at Westwood Ho, we're in North Devon folks. And um, the element of that is how quickly you can do plots. You told me earlier that you jumped on the machine um, some weeks ago and, and had a go yourself because you're an operator as well. And uh, you managed to knock out a few plots yourself using the system and you never used it before. Never used the system before. Somebody showed me how to use the screen, pick the walls on the plots. Within five, ten minutes, uh, Compass meant us with all, the whole of the system. Uh, dug four plots in one day. Four plots in one day and, and literally five minutes uh, worth of experience. That's incredible to, to actually achieve that, Dave. And I think what is really interesting from my point of view is you've actually teamed up with a local engineering firm as well to do all of your 3D models for you. And they're using the surveying equipment from One Point Survey as well. It's the models getting them right in the first place that's important when you come to this, isn't it? Very important. We've never had an issue with Kemp's uh, as regards engineers. All of their work is uh, 100%. And so how is it helping you as a business then not to only deliver for, for clients, but also win more work? Because, you know, it really is a very busy around this area. It's mainly on the cost effectiveness and speed that we're digging these footings, to be fair. It's not only used for footings, it's been used for a, to excavate a pond. Uh, we can use it on the roads for road drainage. We can use it for plot drainage all sorts of advantages with this system. And uh, you've connected this particular machine to an NCON tilt rotator, which is also controlled by the MC1 system. That allows you to reduce the movements of the tracks and, and do other things. Like you say, that pond is shaped in a totally different way, isn't it? The NCON enables batters, enables to sit there, dig corners on footings perfectly. Endless advantage having the NCON on the end. So what we've got here is we've got a brand new system from a company that's really, really expanding. You're expanding your portfolio, you're buying the best equipment from the likes of Volvo. But also, what you were saying to me earlier is there's an, now an attraction to the MGL business for operators because they know you're supplying the best kit and also supplying the machine control from Leica Geosystems. And that helps you attract operators in this environment, which is, you know, it's very competitive, isn't it? The equipment at MJL that buy is always 100%. Never any issues with any equipment from MJL and it's always top quality. We usually end up with the best operators that are operating in the area at the time. Martin, you have had a brand new setup. This EC220 EL Volvo, not only that, an NCON tilt rotator with a load of attachments, all controlled in the cab by the MC1 system from Leica Geosystems. Been digging since October, 600 odd hours on the, the machine. How have you found it all? It's a big change for you, isn't it, all this? Absolutely amazing. It's, it's one lovely bit of kit, yeah. So tell me about what you would do before you started using the, the machine control system, which was put in by One Point Survey. Basically a lot of waiting for engineers, pins. You know, it's just time consuming, whereas this is just so fast. So you're saying to me earlier, you come down in the morning, you know, literally gets his boots on, takes them off, folks, because he really looks after his cab, Martin, and basically you're away, aren't you? Tell me about the process now and how that changes. Fire the, the Leica system up and, and away we go. It's just hit the button on the, on the wall that you want to be digging and, and, and go, just dig. How quickly did you pick it up? Because I know operators are always quite nervous about these things. Yeah, we are nervous because uh, we've always had something to follow on the ground before, whereas now, you can basically go into a green field and it's there on the screen. You've just got to trust with what you're seeing. 
So you used to have other people around the machine as well. This is a big machine, really. Yeah, yeah. And um, you're on a tight site here as well. Yeah. That obviously leaves you with concerns about a sort of people plant interface. And, uh, and as an operator, you want to be looking out of that window, don't you? Yeah, you're looking out of the window, but you're also looking at this now. But yes, there are less people around you. So health and safety wise, you're, you're safer, aren't you? As we look at plots like this and as we look at house building materials like concrete aggregates all going up it's that two meter depth or that one yeah, meter yeah, depth. Yeah. No more overdig, no more overdig. It's, it's on the button all the time. And so that really makes a difference folks because obviously you don't have to come back and rework. No, no, not at all. No, it's 100% all the time. And so fundamentally what Martin can do is have confidence in the machine. That data goes to the team at MJL and they can see that Martin's done all the plots and moved on. And also that allows the teams that are building the houses to come through quicker, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah of course it does. Yeah, the whole, the whole thing is speeded up from, from bucket in the ground to finish, isn't it? And so talk to me a little bit about the tilt rotator because machine control, people normally know it as a standard bucket on the machine going to digs and depths. But with the tilt rotator, it's slightly different, isn't it? Because that, it actually helps control the tilt and the rotate. So you yeah. get different angles, can't you? Yeah, it, it means that we don't necessarily have to have a flat site. We can sit on any level. Instead of jacking a, a track up on some material sometimes, you, you can do it in the bucket action. And um, I was talking to your colleague earlier, Dave, uh, who's the, the manager here on site. Yeah. And he was saying we've also been digging a pond with, with the... We have, the yeah. yeah. Tell me a little bit about that. Again, it's very strange being that you've got nothing but a piece of ground in front of you. And, and all of a sudden you're seeing it on the screen what you have to dig and where you have to dig. And to what levels is, is, is brilliant. It's just absolutely amazing. And so tell me a little bit where those more complex structures, how long would that normally have taken you to do compared to how... Well, you, quick... you'd probably have had to have an engineer come back a, a number of occasions once you've dug it, just to make sure that you've dug it in the right position. And, and with this particular pond, there's a liner to go in it. So we have to over dig it by 500 mil. So you dig it to the level and then you would have lost those levels if an engineer had to come out. Whereas now we've just touch of a button, we can have an offset on the machine. So you're saying to me that fundamentally you've got a model there and yeah. if you've got to put an offset against that model, you, you can do that yeah, yourself? Yeah, I can put the offset in there of 500 mil and it'll, it'll then flash up to me and tell me where the, where, where the overdig is. Martin, what would you say to operators that are experienced like yourself, over 30 years in the seat, folks, um, about that sort of adoption of machine control and in particular the setup you've got? Just go for it. It's absolutely, yeah, it's just amazing. It, I, can't, I can't put it into words. You know what I mean? It just transforms your, your working day. So here with Dave and the team, a very windy Westwood Ho. Um, you're really pumping out the, uh, the plots here, Dave. It's great to see that you're working in this way. The final thought that I'd want to talk to you about is obviously it's the 1st of April coming up very soon. Red to white diesel. We're going to see the cost of fuel going in to this machine rise dramatically. It's a good time for you to have invested in the tilt rotator and the machine control to reduce that fuel burn as well, isn't it? Substantial amount of redu reduction in fuel bills with uh, Encon and the uh, system that's installed into the machine. And of course, folks, this is the very latest Volvo with stage five engine. So and then again, another further reductions. So you really are going to be able to you know, get a maximum profit and maximum productivity out of the plots here, aren't you? Absolutely. It's been fantastic to talk to Dave here today. It really is insightful to see people working on sites, bringing in the latest technology, combining it with tilt rotators and the very latest machines, all reducing the costs and improving efficiency, quality, and therefore making that impact for the environment and that reduction in fuel. And therefore, Dave, we've got a profitable Westwood Ho right now. Cheers very much. Thank you very much.